Loretta Sanchez is a congresswoman from Orange County. She first won office in 1996, and at the end of that election, there were accusations that illegal aliens had voted during the process and impacted the outcome of the vote. Nonetheless, those charges did not stick, and Ms. Sanchez has been the elected congressperson from that section of Southern California for the past 14 years. Ms. Sanchez has managed during that period of time to have one bill passed while she has held office. In addition to that, the number of births to illegal aliens at Orange County hospitals is far higher than when she took office. In addition to that, there are more children of illegal aliens currently attending Orange County public grade schools than at any time in the past. These things, coupled with the fact that Orange County is currently experiencing very high unemployment, even by California's standards, has led to a somewhat difficult re-election bid for Ms. Sanchez that under normal circumstances, in her heavily Democratic district, she would win handily. When questioned about the challenge from her opponent, she recently had this to say on Spanish-language television. Y los vietnameses y los republicanos están uh, con una intensidad de quitar este puesto, este puesto que ya nosotros hemos hecho tanto para nuestra comunidad, quitarnos este puesto y dárselo a este Van Tran, que es muy anti-inmigrante y muy anti-hispano. For the record, her opponent in this election is an immigrant. When questioned a bit further about the subject matter of illegal immigration at a recent debate, here is some of what the Congresswoman had to say. I believe we're a nation of immigrants. And it's so true here in Orange County where we have people from all over the world wanting to live here in Orange County. And you know, we have been working hard. I believe that the real solution to all of this is a comprehensive immigration reform package. Not amnesty, because we would provide legal status that requires immigrants to pay fees, to learn English, to get in line. It would cause them to have responsibility. We should be true to the Statue of Liberty. You know, in my office, we help people all the time who come in with a lot of their immigration issues, including a lot of the Vietnamese community, all immigrant communities are welcome here, they have to get in line, and we should have a program for them. Again, we are a nation of immigrants. I think we need to consider what we do with respect to our nation. First of all, we're a sovereign nation. We should decide who comes in and out. That's what nations do. Uh, but there are some things that are important about this. First of all, family values. We should keep families united not pry them apart. That's wrong. In our economy, you know and I know that a lot of these people coming here are coming here for jobs because they need jobs. And there are jobs here to be had that they will take. So let's be clear. I am for a comprehensive immigration reform. Criminal aliens should be deported. But people who are here, who are deacons in our church, people who are PTA mothers, they might be the soccer coach on your team, on your kids' team. These people should be here. We need to make a process that works. It's important for our country to do that. And my proposal calls for a path to legal status that holds illegals responsible, but points the way to do it right. This is not amnesty, it's pragmatic, and it has compassion. Loretta Sanchez, is she what's best for the future of Orange County and California?